everybody. All right, so today is Thai soldier removal day. And of course, there is a man chainsawing a tree. So it's gonna be kind of a quiet uh, music filled video um, while I rip out, while I hold my earpiece, while I rip out all of that Thai soldier long bean there, all of that Thai soldier long bean there. It's all coming out. He's gonna be loud. Also, I wanna add, because beans are nitrogen fixers, I'm thinking it's a good idea just to cut them off at the root. I'm not gonna pull the roots out. I'm gonna cut it off at ground level at the root and leave those roots and their little nodes and nodules in the ground. I think that's a good idea. I have no scientific proof. Why is it so noisy today? Anyway. So I'm trying to steer clear of the red ants, of course, by the gloves. Um, and also leaf-footed bugs are flying all around me. Okay, so big difference, a lot of light coming through. What I was afraid of is a, a giant ant pile. I don't know if you can see that. That is a red ant mountain. And those beans, ugh, those beans were feeding this ant colony of fire ants. There are billions of them. So all of that, all of that's in my vegetable bed. Flame. Okay, something I found, and I wasn't expecting, but I should have been, and I need to keep a lookout for. There's a chrysalis uh, for one of the skippers. Uh, one of the bean leaf cutting skipper, you know, little butterflies. So I do not want this to end up in the fire pit. Okay, so I'm gonna put this somewhere safe. Okay, I'm glad I saw it. Now I'm gonna have to be extra careful. Okay, so I'm about to do the main tower. A little bit sad about it. It's a nice feature, right? Honestly, if it wasn't swallowing up my Roselle hibiscus behind it, I would leave it. Leaf of the bugs are mad. They're attacking me. It's fine. They're mad. So I've seen leaf of the bugs, squash bugs, weird giant red ants. Crazy. So many pests have been displaced. I'm afraid they're gonna attack. They're gonna attack everything else in the garden, so. And another one laying in the dirt. Um, so I'm gonna put this somewhere safe. Okay, so here's where we are. It's like the middle of the day. I started in the morning, but you know me, I take lots of breaks and I work slow. So I still need to clean up over here. Um, I've got to cut uh, the stumps, the bean stumps out of the ground, rake that up. Now, over here, little barrel is full. The bean tower is down. 
and all the beans that were next to it. So this is looking really good. Uh, I still have some more weeds to remove. I'm really getting to see how stunted my roselle is. It's so much smaller than the other one and there's hardly any leaves on it. Um, yeah, it's not even starting to form flowers yet. Whereas this one's a lot bigger and bushier because it wasn't covered up by the bean and it's gonna get flowers. So that's sad, but that's what happens when I let things get out of control that weren't really worth the effort. So I wanted to show you, we have cucamelons. Yeah, while I was digging out beans, I noticed my cucamelon vines have cucamelons, which probably the leaf of the bugs are gonna be all over it, right? Because they have nowhere else to go. They were living on that bean tower. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Sorry. Look at that. This is what's happening. All the leaf of the bugs are on the last bit of bean. So I'm about to rip that out. I think I ought to dump that whole thing in some soapy water right now. 